I'm a little bit different because technically I am not a board member. Um, I have been providing the financial support for TSA for at least a dozen years, but have been connected with the organization almost back to the time it was founded when I assisted in doing some legal work in connection with the with the founding of the organization. Um, I'm not, like I said, I'm really different. I am an MBA. I teach, I'm an expert in nonprofits. I teach nonprofit management at Johns Hopkins University, but I am a maker. And while I'm sitting here, I will pull up that I am, I, I do quilts and I am a hand, I do it all by hand. And it's, um, it, it, I just find it, it amazingly relaxing. So, uh, so I, I am connected to the textile society in that way. I, I want to say a little bit about the textile society. Over the years, it has been extremely financially responsible. So that we have, and this is no secret because nonprofit finances are available on the internet, if you know where to look, we have, we have uh, a reserve of about $600,000. And that has enabled us, at, unlike many other associations, that as we've gone through uh, the last couple of years where we haven't been able to have the in-person conferences. And when people have, have membership has been tough for all organizations that we have been able to weather the storm. So what we're looking for is it are people too that are interested in maintaining our financial health over the years and looking for people to serve on a finance committee so that they too can, that they can understand how organizations like ours work and help make some of the decisions that have to be made on how we spend our money. So just wanna say I, I'm, I'm proud to be associated with the organization and never once have we missed a payroll ever. 